So we're going to begin setting up the um, RTK network uh, with the DJI Mavic 3 Enterprise. First thing first, you've got to make sure that you've got the RTK units firmly bolted on on your on your Mavic 3 Enterprise. So that unit over there, if that's connected, make sure you have turned off the drone and turned it back on after connecting that unit. And then coming back to Hammer Missions, what you will need to do is go into the uh, settings menu. So if you tap the gear in the settings menu, and then if you go to the RTK setting button at the very bottom, that should open up another menu. And then you can essentially select the network settings. So you select the custom RTK network. Once you've done that, you would have to fill in all of the required details for the network RTK, everything from the URL, the port, the port um, your username and so on and so forth. So once you fill in all the settings, all you do is go, in, go ahead and press connect. And you should see a green label showing that the network RTK has been set up. And that's pretty much it. Uh, you should now have network RTK with your Mavic 3 Enterprise. So what we're going to do here is we're going to go ahead and actually fly a mission with the RTK network connected. So as you can see on the screen, we've got a mapping mission built up over here, which we're also going to process right after the video. So you can have a look at the processed map. Um, so we're going to go ahead and press play. Um, all the pre-flight checks will be uh, looked at, including the network RTK and then you can basically press fly. So at this point, the drone will start taking off and it's going to go ahead and start flying the mission. So at the moment, the drone is going to the correct altitude, uh, which is about 30 meters in this mission. And it's going to go to its initial start point and start flying the mission in the distance. Uh, we can also see the mission on the on the map screen. So you should be able to follow the progress of the mission at all times and see the video at all times. But here you can see the video is pointing down, the camera is pointing down and it's taking images at the required overlap as it um, as it makes its way through the mission. So. And that's basically it. Um, that's how you collect data in the field with the Mavic 3 Enterprise setup uh, with Hammer Missions and the RTK module. Um, I think we're going to now cut into showing you what the process map looks like. So let's have a look at that. So I'm Alex from Hammer Missions. I'll be taking you through the next part. So we've got a new project, which we're going to name RTK Mapping. We're going to go with Other on that. And then we should press Continue and we will add our images from the field. And you can see that's all of our images. Our thumbnails before we continue. Got that top left one there, which is not right. So we're gonna delete that. There we go. There's all our images. Ready to move on to our project. So I press continue and those will now Upload once we've pressed create project. They will upload to the project and we can then move on and process our images. So those are now uploaded. As you can see, we've got all our dots that corresponds with where our photography was taken and click on each one of those. And you can see you get the thumbnail of each shot that was taken with the Mavic 3 Enterprise. RTK. So what we're going to do is we're going to process that into a 3D model. Click process. And then we have to wait for that to process. Once that's processed, we'll come back and we'll have a look and see how we're done. There are now those images have processed. We can still click on each one. Have a look at our corresponding photo. And if we move over to 3D, and there we go. That is our 3D rendered map using RTK. We can click on each one of those dots. We'll, again, we'll correspond with the correct photo. We can rotate around our image. Zoom in. Also remove our cameras. 
we've captured images. We just have our raw 3D image. We can create measurements on those. It's just a standard ruler measurement. Demo, demo that again further over. So measure area. So we'll measure this area here. So there you go. That is RTK mapping using the Mavic 3 and the RTK unit, which is an, an additional bolt-on. Uh, as you can see, the measurements and the quality has come out very, very well. So obviously from here, you can go on and you can share that data and you can also report on that data. So if you like our video, drop us a like. If you have any comments, please feel free to give us a comment. And if you need to contact us, please email team at hammermissions.com. Thanks very much for watching.